Hi guys, it's Jen from Jen and Zoe, and today I will be doing the secret diary of a YouTuber tag. So I was tagged by uh, Crystal from Brought to You by Mum. She's also done the tag, so check hers out, um, and I'll link her below. So to the questions, number one was how long have you been on YouTube? So I've been watching YouTube, I only started watching YouTube to look up um, stuff during my pregnancy with um, Zoe, my first baby, back in 2010. Um, she was born in 2011, but yeah, when I was pregnant in 2010, that's when I first started looking. Um, and I have been posting exactly two years ago, September 2012, that's when I put my first video up of Zoe as an 18 and a half oh. month old. So go scroll back to my very first video and you'll see how similar these two are. It's so cute looking at her back then. Oh. I wish I'd started earlier. <clears throat> but yeah, so I did some videos back then, um, on off, not very much. I actually did make some pregnancy vlogs of this one, but for personal reasons, I didn't end up putting them up, um, unfortunately. I wish I had have documented her whole pregnancy and Zoe's whole pregnancy, but I didn't. So I've really only been posting more regularly again since uh, January this year. Um, yeah, and updates on the girls was what I first sort of did and then have progressed and done beta, etc. So number two was, at what point do you think you'll stop? I don't think I'll ever stop. Maybe there'll be periods where it dies off a little, but I don't see myself ever stopping now. I've started. Number three was best thing about being on YouTube. I have to say um, learning, sharing, um, teaching, just networking really, like finding, you know, we're all mums and we always want to do the best for our kids and seeing as I'm part of, you know, I always... I'm more interested in family channels or mum channels. Um, yeah, I'd have to say the best thing is yeah, learning from others, teaching others, finding out new ideas, new ways to do things, and just sharing in other people's lives, you know, watching them grow. How cool is it to watch them grow, you know? Uh, worst thing about YouTube would be um, it's time consuming. Uh, yeah, you wouldn't think there's a lot of work to go into just a few minutes, but um, when you're filming, especially with kids, it can take a long time, um, and there's late nights, and, but you know what, I love it, um, that's why I do it, so, uh, yeah, there might be some downsides, but I do it because I love it. Ah, another worst thing would also have to be the hate. There are some people who get, get a lot of hate, and a lot of opinions but I guess that comes from being you know as Crystal said you know with a lot of women in one place it's bound to happen <laughs> uh, number five how many thumbnail options do you take so obviously thumbnails are little pictures you put with your video um, thumbnail options I take probably I really sometimes I forget I try and take a screenshot of somewhere some point during the video but sometimes I just pause at the start or the end and I use that. Uh, YouTube crush. So number six is you, um, your YouTube crush and number seven is who's on my collab wish list. So I might sort of merge these questions together. I don't really have a YouTube crush I guess because I don't crush on women but I don't even crush on guys really either. So <laughs> Um, I have a lot of likes and people I look up to, um, so I guess they may be a crush. My very first person I started watching was Jess from Gabe and Jess, so yeah, I love um, watching, I still love watching her and watching her grow, and there's been other people I've seen that have been nobodies and become real successful, like Missy Lanning, um, and Erin from Erin and Baby, like, you know, they've all become pretty successful. Um, but yes, so yeah, they're the people, they're the big people, I guess, but on, you know, the other people I like are obviously Crystal, um, and Dana from Mr. <laughs> Sorry, there's a lot of people, <laughs> there's a lot of people from the YouTube Mummy Meetup, um, that I really enjoy watching, mm -hmm. and yeah, 
Crystal, Rachel from Rachel and Babies, um, Dana from Miss Diaper D, Courtney from Carl and Court, uh, Erin from Erin Baby, Gemma from Gemma Times, Brittany and Baby, Missy Lanning. Yeah, there's quite a few. Um, on my collab wish list would be those people also. Um, Gemma Times, Gemma from Gemma Times actually lives in the area, so that would be awesome if we could actually tee something up and do a collab where we're like in the same video. So, because you know, it's hard when you're on YouTube and it's predominantly, you know, people that aren't from your area. But yeah. Uh, number eight. What's on my bottom half? So, that's just my jeans and my shoes. I know, um, I guess filming, you don't have to, if you're just filming, you know, your face, because um, that's where you talk from. <laughs> uh, you know, it doesn't really matter what's on your bottom half, but I don't really get, I don't get dressed for um, YouTube videos. Whatever I'm wearing for the day is what's on my bottom half. Um, and usually when I do the videos, yeah, I just usually get dressed for the day. I don't, I'm not wearing my workout stuff. Oh, I do like, I did get dressed up sometimes during Vader, like, um, for my workout video, <laughs> I um, ended up, <laughs> just like a distraction. Yeah, for my workout video, I put on some workout stuff. And for Super Mum tag, I put on a Superman thing. So, but yeah, for the most part, no, I don't get dressed. And whatever's on my bottoms, usually there's jeans a lot during winter and during summer, funnily enough, jean shorts. <laughs> Number nine is how long till you actually click record? I usually click record straight away sometimes this it takes longer to like I edit it out um, the, the beginning bit just depends how long it takes for me to get settled with especially about kids in um, number 10 how do you feel about the YouTube family culture I have to say <laughs> you're being adorable I'd have to say I really love the YouTube family culture especially the YouTube mummy meetup um, and I think everyone's pretty supportive I really I'm sure there's people that aren't but <laughs> I haven't really come across anyone that isn't and I enjoy networking and seeing everyone's cool ideas you know even what you have for dinner okay number 11 is secret to a successful channel so um, I don't have one so I guess I don't have any secrets but um, from what I've seen from the better people you know just be yourself um, there's no point in not being yourself on YouTube uh, and if you be yourself and you do things you enjoy and make videos of things you enjoy then that will shine through and people are drawn to that sort of thing so those things and I guess um, watch watch successful people if you want to be successful watch successful people see what they do sometimes they put up videos and hints on what to do yeah I'd have to say uh, to be successful also put a lot of time in work mm -hmm try and keep your quality up and network collab with other people that you're interested in and are interested in you so that is my secret diary of a youtuber tag with help from alexandra i really hope you enjoyed it and i'm going to tag try and think of people that haven't already done this because people that have done this like i would tag <laughs> So um, I'd say uh, Lava's mum, time from Lava's mum, Erin, Erin Baby, Angela from Angela and Mama Land, Kelsey from The Yankee Abroad, and Emma from The Dodge Family. Um, I'm not sure that any of these people have done them yet, so hopefully you guys do it too. Um, it's a fun little tag and I'd love to see your answers. So, and thank you very much, Crystal, for tagging me to do this. It's really good, good one to do. I'm glad I've gotten to do it. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.